and we've got two game pieces placed for the Blue Alliance as well as a cube placed over for the Red Alliance. Pike is working on balancing and engaging on that charge station. Meanwhile, Las Pumas has done the same. Westside Bowler Invasion is able to get a cube into the top row in one of their outer grids. We've got Team Roboto working on placing a cone for the Red Alliance, so they're able to get it into the low row on one of their outer grids. Pike coming in to place a cube into their co-op grid. Got Purple Precision lining up a cone, and with their precision, they were able to get it placed. They're able to quickly grab a cube and are working on creating that link into one of their outer grids. And grabbing yet another game piece. So, well, working on it, but looks like it's just out of reach. Got Las Pumas coming in with a cone for the Blue Alliance, followed by West Side Boiler Invasion completing that link in their top row of their co-op grid. Purple Precision coming in to complete their final top row cone. And they're able to get three links in their top row. Each game piece is worth five points. Each link is worth five points. They're, they're able to get a lot of points from that. Over on the Red Alliance, we have Team Roboto working on getting a cone into their top row as well on their outer grid. Oh, it looks like they're working on getting into the middle row, and they're able to successfully place it. Pike comes in with another cube onto their low row. Their low row is almost all filled out. That would be three links if they're able to get that last one in there. Team Roboto goes, goes on ahead and gets engaged on their charging station, joined by Pike, trying to work together to get that charging station balance so that they can get those extra engagement points. Las Pumas has already set themselves up for the Blue Alliance. Meanwhile, Westside Boiler Invasion finishes off another link for the Blue Alliance and then joins Las Pumas on their charging station. Purple Precision working on getting one last game piece to finish off yet another link, but run out just barely with time. Let's see how these scores shake out. to see our scores. And the winner is the Blue Alliance. With the final score of 140, keeping Westside Boiler Invasion in that first place slot. The Red Alliance was still able to grab an extra ranking point because of their charge station points.